<clears throat> Good evening. Happy Friday. It's time to get real. Good evening. Happy Friday. It's time to get real. So I'm feeling better than yesterday, but not great. Definitely not 100%. And um, symptoms are just like body aches, fatigue, cough, um, some congestion. Um, I'm not going to say loss of appetite, but nothing really tastes that great. Um, I feel okay one minute, and then the next minute, I'm just like, oh, I need to sit down. Um, so kind of just like loss of energy and, but I'm definitely feeling much better than yesterday. And it got me to thinking, so this morning I still got up, I still did all of my success habits. I did my silence, my affirmations, my visualization, my reading, my writing. Um, I drank quite a bit of water today, probably not all 60 ounces. And then, um, I still, I still connected with people. I didn't listen to my podcast either. That was the other thing I didn't do was listen to Rob Dial today. Um, and did that and then just been kind of taking it easy and just doing things when I feel like doing things and resting when I feel like resting. So I was very fortunate and blessed to have the opportunity to do that today. And it's definitely helping. Um, what I didn't do for my success habits was work out. I didn't exercise, not even the 10 minutes. And the reason I didn't exercise was because I didn't feel like it. I just didn't have the energy. And sometimes exercise is not what your body needs. And so I chose not to do it yesterday and I chose not to do it today. And so as a rule of thumb, you know, to answer the question, should I exercise when I'm sick? A rule of thumb for me is that if I don't feel well from the neck up, then yes, I'll go ahead and exercise. So if it's just like I have a little bit of a sore throat, my nose is stuffy or my head is a little bit congested, you know, or itchy eyes, like allergy kind of thing, yeah, I'll still go ahead and work out. So anything above the neck, yes, if I feel bad, I'll still work out. Anything below the neck. So when you're talking breathing issues, um, you know, some nausea, sometimes digestion issues, um, and so if I feel bad in that way, so again, basically breathing or digestion, if it's really bad, then no, I won't work out. And so that's kind of how I feel today. There was one time, I didn't know it, that I had pneumonia and I tried to push through and you guys, I was so sick. I was so sick. So I learned my lesson then. I remember going, I remember like we, Mike and I had um, like plans with friends and we decided to go anyway. I'm like, no, 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 I'll, I'm going to go. I was sweating the whole night and just, I felt out of it. And I just had this pain in my back and I couldn't breathe. And I just kept pushing through. And I'm like, I don't know what's wrong with me. I, you know, I'm not sure. And then you decide you're going to go to the doctor. And then you're thinking, no, I think I feel better. So that was on a Sunday. The next day, on a Monday, I went to the doctor. Yeah, I had pneumonia. And the doctor said to me, you either go home and sit on the couch, do nothing, and what by nothing, I mean nothing, don't even get up, or you go into the hospital. I'm like, mm, I'll take door A, please. And so I came home, and I did nothing for a week. Um, my parents came over and stayed with me and um, took care of the kids, and it was, it was you know, lovely of them. And um, anyway, so... Um, I learned my lesson then that you don't push through. If you're not feeling good from the neck down, please don't work out. It is not what your body needs. It is, it's not going to benefit you. It's going to be to your detriment. Your body needs to heal and rest and use, use its energy, use its energy stores on making you better, not using its energy. You're, and if you are working out, you're using up your energy stores. And so um, that's kind of my rule of thumb as to should you work out when you are sick. Anything above the neck, feeling ill, go ahead, work out. Anything below the neck, don't do it. So that's just kind of what I have for you today. 
Um, touching on what you should eat. when What I eat when I don't feel well, I always try to stay hydrated. I've been trying to load up on my vitamin C, drink my orange juice, take um, some vitamin C, you know, vitamins, um, drink a lot of water, stay away from coffee, stay away from alcohol, obviously, things that dehydrate you. Um, just try to stay hydrated and then I just eat whatever sounds good. I don't have, I don't adhere to a strict diet of any kind when I am not feeling well like this. When I feel like eating, I eat. And when I don't, I don't. As long as I'm staying hydrated, I'm fine. And then um, usually what sounds good to me is dry toast. So I, and crackers and Coke, that's my go-to thing. I know it's got caffeine in it, but that's what makes me feel better when I'm queasy. So, you know, that's just, just kind of listen to whatever it is that sounds good to you and eat when you can, um, but just stay hydrated. So just basic common sense nothing new there, but I wanted to touch on the exercise thing. So um, hope that helps you guys today. Hope everybody out there is feeling well and is healthy. And I uh, hope you have a great night and I will see you tomorrow. Thanks for listening. Peace.